Now let's see another important command in NDML that is update. Update command is used for alter the column's value in a table, right? So in DDL we have seen a command called as alter, right? What it was doing? It was altering the existing table properties that is adding an extra field or uh, modifying the existing data type right so here in DML as it deals with manipulating so this update command is used to alter the columns value in a table right so we are you going to use two different clauses so one is set clause and as is an where class okay so that means you already have a data where you want it to modify something to that particular data so below is a sample example you can see update EMP1 set employee salary equal to some 12,000 right so that means what it will do is so whatever whatever the records that are existing in that employee table all the records gets updated with the latest salary that is 12,000 earlier it might be some some value that might be a 10,000 or 8,000 or whatever the number it might be so by this command it will update all the records of that particular field with this latest value that means uh, how many records it had it had only two records so it has updated those two records okay now we will see so there will be a scenario where or the business case where you wanted to update the salary of a particular employee all right so now a where clause comes into the picture so where now first what I will do is select star from EMP1 and I want to see how many records are there there are two records and you can see 12,000 12,000 earlier we used a command right so update a set EMP salary 12,000 so it has set page to 12,000 now now I wanted to update employee uh, 101 salary to 10,000 back so how to update that so update EMP1 set employee salary equal to 10,000 okay and where employee ID equal to 101 so this is simple right so I'm using just where class here and giving a specific condition where employee ID is equals to 101 or you can update you can use various other conditions depending on the business case or what you want to update so I can say like this update command is very powerful so when you are working with the large tables where you have hundreds of fields and you wanted to modify a specific fields based on the conditions right thank you